Well, it's 5,000 kilometres since I did the catch can installation. So I'm just pulling everything apart just to check everything's okay and have a look at the pipes, see how much oil is coming in and out, and I'm gonna pull the intake manifold and have a look at the intake ports to see if there's any change. Uh, first thing is the, and I'm not gonna show you because I emptied it the other day, but the cup that sits down uh, underneath here has collected probably, I measured about 60 millilitres of oil. So it seems to be working fine. Everything's nice and secure. The two hoses, so the top one here, which is the one that goes to it, so it comes from the air old separator. That is dripping with oil. I'm not sure if you can see that, but that's clearly very wet with oil. And as per every other time, the return, which is the one that comes out of the, out of the catch can, that is bone dry. So I'm expecting that nothing is coming out of here. It's all being collected and going into my cup underneath it. To be perfectly honest, I'm really, really impressed with what this thing is doing. Obviously, I haven't had a look at this just yet. I looked at it 2,000 kilometers after install, and I'm going to, this is 5,000 kilometers, so it'll be interesting to see if there is any difference, but certainly from what I can see here, there's certainly no oil coming out of this thing that is going to be going into the intake manifold. We'll just remove the intake manifold and the intake runners for uh, bank two on the left hand side because I don't want to pull this off because it's just a bit of a pain to pull this one out and I'm going to compare it to some photos I took of the intake ports of when I did the same thing at 2,000 kilometers so 3,000 kilometers ago uh, first impressions this thing's bone dry on the inside there is just no oil in here at all same with the intake itself normally you would end up with a whole bunch of oil around the lips here when you took this off and on the on the head where this connection there's just nothing at all and i'll put up the photos now of at 2000 kilometers and at 5000 kilometers now and there's absolutely no carbon build up at all in fact to me it looks like there's a little bit less so the little bit of carbon that was on the valves at 2,000 kilometers, because I think there was still some residual oil after I had put the catch can on, still in the system, which ended up on the valves. Honestly, that seems to have burnt off. It seems a bit strange. You can make your own judgment, but certainly from what I can see, it's not building up. So uh, enough said, this thing's staying on. It's definitely not coming off. I am really, really impressed with how this is working. Uh, I'll probably do another update maybe in a few years time. I'll be checking this regularly just to see that it's all secure and the pipes are all working. But as far as updates of how the carbon build up is going, I'll do that maybe in a few years time at maybe 20,000 kilometres or so.